Hello, my most beautiful Pisces. How are you? I hope you guys are all doing well. So, my lovelies, we are going to be doing your 18th through the 24th weekly reading. It is a general reading. It will not be able to, you know, resonate for all of you. So, if you want something that is meant for your exact energy, I do have personals open. Everything you guys need to know about this reading or about scheduling your personals, all of that will be in the description box for you. So, Archangels, Spirit Guides, and Ancestors, please deliver clear messages with a very clear understanding for my most beautiful Pisces, please. May the messages that need to be heard the very most please come through. And may they please find those who need to hear it. Please show me Pisces energy. May the messages that need to be heard the very most please come through. And may they please find those who need to hear it. I have been pulling three, but intuitively, I just felt like that fourth one was supposed to be for you. And yeah, three out of four major arcanas. Whatever the situation is, it's having a major impact on you. We're going to say that. Now let's take a look at the person you're dealing with and see what's going on with them. We're going to pull four for them as well. All right. So the person you're dealing with, they have the Four of Cups, the Seven of Pentacles, the Page of Cups, and the Knight of Swords. So I do feel like this person is kind of overthinking. I do feel like they could be having some worries about being rejected here. I do feel like a little bit of analysis paralysis. They're, you know, haven't taken the action quite yet because, you know, they're really overthinking. I do feel like this person could be a little bit worried about rejection here. But I do feel like they're going to choose to reach out and communicate. This person wants to express some kind of emotion to you, some kind of interest. I do feel like they're making up their mind here. Now, you. You have the lover's card, the ten of swords in the reverse, the world in the reverse, and the hermit. I do feel like there's somebody here that you guys have been separated from. And it feels like a very divine connection for you. And I do feel that you are not ready for this to come to an end. It feels very open for you still. And you still really want this. Okay? And you're very sure about that. Um, but I do feel like something new is trying to come in. I do feel like this is a, a totally new energy. Okay? But let's take a look and see. Tell me about this. Tell me about this Four of Cups energy. Why is the Four of Cups here? Why is the Four of Cups here? The Three of Pentacles. So they really do want something. They think you guys would make a great team. They think that you guys would work well together. You guys would get along. They think that you guys would be a great pair. They're just worried about being rejected. Some of you guys could work with this person. Um, and that could be something that they're a little bit concerned about too. Is messing up, you know, a potential, a potential work relationship. Um, if you don't work together and you guys are friends, maybe this is somebody that you're friends with. Because I feel like the Three of Pentacles can be that as well. Um, they could be worried about messing up your friendship too. So tell me about this, and that's why, the, that's one of the things they keep thinking about. If they get rejected, how that's going to affect, you know, your guys' other types of relationships. Now tell me about the Seven of Pentacles. Why is that here? The King of Swords in the reverse. I feel like it's just them not being sure. They're not 100% they're not sure about what your feelings are, um, about how you feel, what you think about them. Um, and it's really causing them to be, you know, very in their head very unclear. Tell me about this page of cups. The six of cups. Tell me about this page of cups. Five of cups. I do feel like this person, I, okay, I do feel that this person either works with you or you guys are friends because I do feel like this person knows you. They do feel here um, that you are still grieving something from your past and that could be another influence about why this person hasn't wanted to reach out and um, because I do feel like they still they still know that you're grieving something from your past here now tell me about this knight of swords why is this knight of swords here the six of swords choosing to move towards you anyways that's what they want to communicate communicate they want to be able to help you through whatever you're going through they're really interested they want to be here for you now tell me about this. Tell me about this lover's card. Why is the lover's card here for Pisces? The page of cups in the reverse. So somebody that you feel like the one that got away. Tell me about this ten of swords in the reverse. 
five of wands. There could have just been a lot of conflict, a lot of arguing, a lot of drama between the two of you. Tell me about this. Tell me about, or you feel like things ended because this person wouldn't fight for the connection. Maybe you feel like they gave up too soon. Tell me about the world in the reverse. The seven of pentacles in the reverse. Yeah, they didn't want to invest any more into this. They didn't want to put any time, effort, and energy into it. And you feel like they gave up on the connection that they chose not to fight. And I feel like that felt like a betrayal to you. That was really painful for you. Tell me about this hermit energy. The Knight of Wands in the reverse. Yeah, things haven't been moving forward. This person hasn't been showing any interest. And I do feel like you are taking that into account too. But you're still not ready to let this go. I still feel like you still have been really holding on to this person. But I do feel like somebody brand new is trying to come in for you. Let's get some additional messages. And then we're going to pull some action cards. Express your love. Go ahead and make the romantic gesture. Engagement, your love life is ascending to a higher level of commitment. And retreat, it's time to disconnect from the world. Give your relationship a chance at the bottom of the deck. So I do feel like somebody is going to be coming in and expressing something. They do want to take you guys to a higher level. So wherever you guys are at, if you guys are just work buddies or you guys are just friends, you know, they want more than that with you. Okay, and I feel like they are going to be reaching out. And Spirit is asking you just try to stay present in the moment and to really just spend some time to give it a shot to at least be open to it. You don't necessarily have to do it, but I feel like with this retreat, Spirit is asking you to take some time, you know, meditating, contemplating, going within, and, you know, at least at least being open to the idea of it, really sitting with that and what that would look like and what that would feel like for you. So let's get some action cards and see what we've got going on. What actions will this person be taking towards Pisces? We got the Empress. We got the Four of Swords. So... I do feel like this person's willing to be, I'm sorry, the Four of Swords in the reverse. So whatever they've been holding on, they're going to be, like, whatever they've been being quiet about, I feel like they're ready to express that to you. They're coming out of that quiet period and ready to express. I do feel like they want growth with you. They want expansion with you with the Empress being there as well. They're very attracted to you, and I feel like they're, they're, they're ready to tell you that. What actions will Pisces be taking towards this person? Okay, the Nine of Pentacles in the reverse, so maybe there could be something here. The Ten of Cups and the world in the reverse. So even though I feel like things still feel very open to you, I do feel like you could be ready to start a new cycle, okay, with that world in the reverse. The Ten of Cups, I do feel like you're starting to open up to the idea that maybe something else could make you happy. Maybe somebody else could make you happy. Maybe there's more for you out there. All right, so this is what I have for you, my beautiful Pisces. And if this resonates, please let me know in the comments down below. And if it doesn't, check out your other sign placements. Sometimes your moon rising and Venus can resonate more than your sun sign does. If you like the way that I read, please like, share, and subscribe. And guys, if you hit that notification bell, then when our monthlies, our mid-monthlies, and our weeklies are uploaded, you can be notified and you can go check them out. Um, but most importantly, if you want personal prayers for any reason at all, just put the little prayer emoji in the comments down below and I will go through and I will pray for you. So I am sending so much love and light until next time.